All right, guys, get up for tomorrow's workout. Alex is going to show us the movements. Our warm up is going to start with a 200 meter run or a one minute of cardio. Uh, next, we're going to go into five leg swings. So, we're going to go five forward, five side to side, and switch sides. After that, we're going to go into a seated straight leg uh, hamstring stretch. So, starting out with wide feet and just stretching side to side. We'll probably spin up 30 seconds or so here, and then we're going to bring our feet together and try and reach underneath our toes or our calves. After that, we're gonna hop up and do 10 lateral lunges. So nice wide stance, trying to drive that knee over that toe, keeping the chest up and heels loaded. So five per side, and then after that ankle mobility, whether you're using your body weight or a dumbbell, a weight of some sort, just driving that knee forward to get a little bit more mobility in the ankles. Um, after that, we're going to do 10 bodyweight squats with external hip rotation. So full squat and then basically up and over with that knee, alternating side to side. Uh, then we're going to go into 10 uh, second couch stretch per side two times. So just a quick hold here, opening up that hip flexor, getting a good stretch, switching to the other side, whether you're using your couch or a wall or a bench, we're going to do two sets there. Uh, then we're going to go into 10 hip thrusts, so lying on your back, both feet on the ground, lifting and then squeezing those glutes. You can eat, also do a single leg, um, focusing on one side at a time. So 10 total there. And then last, we got 10 alternating lunges. So whether it's forward or back, driving through that front foot, the front heel, keeping that chest up. All right, so that's our warm up. Our uh, strength tomorrow is back squats, week seven of 11. Uh, we're still in wave two. Um, so your percentages will be going off of your max back squat with an additional 10 pounds. So projecting that your max is more than what it is. So if his max is 100 pounds, he's gonna go off of 110, okay? Mm. So rep schemes or reps are gonna start off uh, five at 35%, working all the way up to 85%. Uh, for a max set of max reps at that last weight. So dig deep, try to get as many reps as you can in at 85%. <coughs> back squat. The barbell is on your back. You want to grip it nice and tight. Bring those hands in as close as you can. And then bringing the elbows into our sides. So trying to pull that bar into our body. Um, everything's tight and engaged. You're going to hinge. You're going to drive your hips back. Keeping that chest nice and tall. Driving the knees out. Putting, making sure that you're driving through the bottom out of your feet. Driving out of the bottom through your heels. So you should not be on your toes, making sure you're sitting back. So um, back squat, for those of us who do not have a barbell, we are gonna be doing uh, two parts. Part A is heavy Bulgarian squats or split lunges. So putting one foot on a bench or a couch of some sort, drive that back knee back and try and get that front quad parallel to the ground as much as you can, making sure you're driving through your heels. So uh, heavy meaning we're also gonna try and add weight as we go. If you wanna do split lunges, get into that split stance, drop that back knee, lightly tap through the ground, stand it up and squeeze the glutes at the top. So again, increasing weight as we go if you can. Uh, part B is five sets of seven weighted one and a quarter squats. So, Getting weight again on your body, doing a full squat below parallel, coming up above parallel, going back down below parallel, and then driving all the way up for one. There's two, okay? And then last in this is gonna be sumo deadlift. So standing directly over your weight, hips are higher than your knees, and driving again through those heels, standing up nice and tall. So five sets uh, of those two movements, super setting, all right? After we get done with our strength tomorrow, we are gonna do our wad, which is called rest day. Uh, first movement is 34 uh, alternate lunges total. So 17 per side. So cleaning, using that bar either on your front rack or back rack, whatever you feel most comfortable, and doing 34 total lunges with that bar. After that, you're gonna do 20 sit-ups. After your sit-ups, so all the way down, all the way up. After your sit-ups, you're going to get the bar back onto your back. 34 back squats. So clean and jerk it up and over safely onto your back for 34 back squats. 
So in between barbell movements or dumbbell movements, you are doing squats. Or, I'm sorry, 20 sit-ups every time. So after your 34 back squats, you got 20 sit-ups. Reps are going to go down, 24 lunges now, weight's going to go up. 20 sit-ups, 24 back squats, 20 sit-ups. Uh, 14 lunges, weight goes up there again. So you're just kind of following reps, skiing, and increasing your weight each time. 18 minute time cap, you guys. For us, you do not have a barbell. We are gonna go with dumbbells or kettlebells. Again, trying to get that weight onto our body. So doing his lunges, however that looks with the weight, and then getting that weight on your body for the back squats. And then if you guys can, add weight as you go uh, with the dumbbells. That would be ideal. So you're kind of going through the same thing as everybody else is, adding weight as they go and decreasing their reps. So hope you guys have a good day. We love you and enjoy your rest day. Woo. Bye guys. Good, good.